Android is a Linux-based open-source mobile operating system developed by Android Inc. and later acquired by Google. Android is at the top of the list among several mobile operating systems like iOS, Windows, and BlackBerry. As of 2016, Android is covering the 87.8% OS market share, whereas popular OS like iOS is sharing the market share of 11.5% and followed by the window with 0.4% market share and remaining by other mobile operating system. There are about 2.6 million apps in Google Play Store and 1.4 billion Android users worldwide and 1.5 million Android activation every day. Android developer salary ranges from $49,000 to $121,000 per year and it is still increasing by 6% every year. Salary of an Android developer varies greatly depending upon the experience and places. If you are from Asian country, Android developer salary might look little less compared to the US based Android, Android developer salary mentioned above but yet comparatively high compared to the other jobs Asian, other jobs in Asian country. If you are from South Asian country, then you can expect salary about about 100,000 rupees, that is 1 lakh to 1 million, that is 10 lakhs rupee per year with good experience and place. Since Android is open source, you can directly jump into learning Android apps development without investing a single penny from various online sources. And the documentation site has has well structured documents for beginners to export label solution. It has a well powerful development framework called Android Studio, which, are, which allows us to develop highly complex apps in an easy way. It has it has an open market marketplace and it is easy to integrate with the web application and services. We can develop various kinds of apps based on our requirements. Android app can be broadly categorized as music app, sports, weather, news, books, navigation, business, references, food and drinks, social media, utilities, finance, lifestyle, travel, and many more. Following are the skills that, that you will be needing in order to be an Android developer. So the first skill is Java. Java is one of the most popular language in today's software development world and it is the and it is in the se number second after C programming. Android also uses Java as its base programming language for developing apps. You don't need to know everything about Java to get started with Android development. We recommend that we recommend that you first learn the concept of loops, control structure and OOP in Java. As time goes on, you need to learn complex parts of Java as well. However, we can also develop Android apps using C, C++, making the use of native development kit. But Google recommends us to use the SDK and Java language. So the third skill that you need to have is XML. XML has similar syntax to that of HTML. And if you are already familiar with the HTML syntax, then understanding XML will be a lot easier. Android uses the XML for user interface and describing data. So the third skill that you will need is SQL. SQL stands for Standard Query Language. Android uses SQLite for storing application data locally in a smartphone. It is necessary to understand the basis of SQL to get started with Android. When we are working in a real application, then we might need to store the application data into server's database. For big data, no SQL databases are also used. So the number fourth skill that you will be needing is Android SDK knowledge. Various components are responsible for giving you for giving a user a smooth giving a user a smooth feeling while using app. Many of them belong to the part of Android SDK. For example, action bar, list view, adapters, fragments, life activity lifecycle, content providers, views, recycle view, and many other parts of Android SDK. So following are the tools that you will be needing while developing apps in Android Studio. So first one is Java JDK and second one is itself Android SDK, Android Studio. And number third one is software development kit that is SDK, which we need to download after installing the Android Studio. So and the fourth one is you need to have we, we need to have either Window or Mac or Linux with minimum of 3 GB RAM but Google recommends us to have the 8GB RAM for developing apps using Android Studio. 
So thank you for watching and I will see you in the next part where we will be installing the Java JDK 